Good morning there, Murray's readers and leaders. This is Arthur Roy Murray from Hollywood, Florida. Glad to see you again. Uh, I'm up early this morning. Get this book review out of the way. Got a lot of things to do today. Uh, this book review is on Wrong Place, Wrong Time by David Perlmutter. Uh, I really enjoyed the book. Uh, I was wondering how I was going to tell you uh, the book review of this. I'm not going to give you the story that's uh, defeat the purpose of a book review, but I can tell you this is a gripping story. Uh, I understand where David's coming from. I've been there. I wrote my own thriller, the Audubon Caper, in my autobiography, and I know what he went through. I I started out with 500 pages and ended up with 160 after going to school and and uh, writing this book, my book. However, David's book is what I'm here to talk about. David's book is a gripping book. I understand where he's coming from. Uh, he leaves London after a befuddled situation <coughs> where he, he is a professional. And things just don't go his way. And he goes off to Spain to get his mind together. And uh, he ends up in a situation where he's on the other side of the law. I know I've been there. It's a very difficult thing to write about. And in David's book, it's very insightful. Ah. Uh, it's complicated. It's thoughtful. Um, I read a book uh, just a little while ago, The Soul of the World. If you missed the uh, book review, go back, check it out. And in it, we're told that over generations, we, as a human race, uh, I'll get to, as a human race, we get embedded in our minds certain things that we, certain ways of doing things, how we should do things. And in David's case, he makes a misjudgment in uh, in an ep episode, and he believes he's right. He does it, and it ends up, he ends up on the other side of the law with a major problem. <clears throat> and he gets out of it, but it keeps you on the edge. The whole book at the end really keeps you holding. It kept me holding as a reader. And I hope you get it. Uh, it's a good book. Uh, I recommend it highly. Uh, many people do. He's got a lot of five stars there on Amazon. Uh, and there's no reason why you shouldn't get it if you like the the thriller genre. My next review in the series is going to be on a Donald, on Daniel Kemp's book, uh, one of his books. Like David, like David, he wrote a number of books, and uh, he's English too. <laughs> and it seems those Englishmen, since Ian Fleming, have read fantastic thrillers and David's book is a is a thriller you, you won't put down I read it a while back uh, I read my way his other book on how he promoted his book uh, I hope you get it see you later